Hey there everybody, this is Joey and I'm doing a test today. I'm doing a test of a newer ND variable filter. I've never used a variable ND filter before, so I'm going to try it on my Canon T5i. I got it from Amazon. And uh, it's, I'm overexposed right about here because there's a lot of sun right now and the box is white, so that's overexposed. So I'm going to take some shots or take some video with this newer variable ND filter and see if that can help my exposure. Okay, so I'm at my local park and as you can see the field and the sky and everything is really blown out and overexposed. That's because I'm at ISO 100 and I'm at f3.6, 1 over 50th shutter speed and uh, frame rate is 24 frames per second. So let's see what happens when I add the filter. Okay, so that actually helped quite a bit. Um, the sky is still overexposed a little bit, so I'm going to adjust it let's see well let's see all right that helped the field quite a bit um, the sky is still overexposed I don't know if there's anything we can do about that let's try to darken it just a little bit more so now this is not quite all the way dark, but it's at ISO 350, still the same settings, um, but everything aside from the sky looks exposed correctly. Um, the sky is still really exposed because of the bright sun. I don't think there's anything you can really do about that, but let's turn this a little bit to see what happens when you get a little bit lighter. So the newer ND variable filter seems to work. It gets the exposures. You can adjust it up and down. I have it on right now and I can tell that I'm not overexposed where I was before. I guess I was over here. I, I'm not ex overexposed now so it's the correct exposure. So it's doing exactly what it's supposed to. I'll leave a link to where you can purchase it in the description. And that's all the test I have for today. Thanks for watching.